everyone and welcome back to my channel I've literally just hopped out the shower obviously do excuse the state of um, the fake tan on my robe this will be getting a wash today um, <laughs> So today is the first day where we can finally, finally, finally go in to shops. I cannot tell you how excited I am just to have a bit of normality back. Like, honestly, it's going to be so nice. Just going into Zara, me and Harvey have got dinner booked tonight. Um, got a nice few bits planned. I was organised with situations because I was like, right, I'm, I have booked things. I booked things like honestly a month ago because I was like, need to get things to look forward to. We have got some nice bits planned. So I thought I would just vlog the week really. As you can tell, I've just jumped out of the shower. I'm just putting on some moisturiser. And I was also going to show you guys what skin care, uh, what hair care I've been using at the moment. Um, just because I do get a lot of questions about my hair and I never really do it much about, like I don't really do anything on my hair. So I thought I would just show you what what I've been using really and what I do use on my hair. Um, I literally just put on this moisturizer which is actually an overnight sleeping cream. So it's really, really thick. It's the one I got off Amazon in that video not so long ago. I also got my nails done today. How nice are my nails? They're a bit, like they're not, they're not something I would normally go for, but I just love it. I feel like a new woman. I really, really, really do. Nails done. You know, I'm going out for dinner tonight. Life is good. And I cannot wait to go to Zara this week either because I cannot stand the website. It gives me pure anxiety that I haven't bought or shopped in Zara for literally since January. January. But yeah, how are we all feeling, guys? How, um how excited are we like what's your first things that you're going to be going off and doing the first thing i use on my hair is this grow gorgeous uh hair growth serum i just love it i mean whether i don't know if it does necessarily make your hair grow but i basically just stick a couple of bits on my scalp it smells divine this brand i came across i got sent some of their products in one of those like beauty box things and I just love the smell of their stuff. Like their stuff's actually really good. They're not like a big, huge brand, but their stuff's great. So check out Grow Gorgeous if you guys are looking for a nice shampoo or conditioner. I actually just got sent, they did kind of gift me, um, their shampoo and conditioner. I got the Intense Thickening Shampoo. I've tried the pink one before, I'm not sure. I think it was called The Volume. It smelled unreal. So now I'm gonna try the Intense one. So yeah, that's the first thing that I do with my hair. At the moment, hair shampoo wise, I'm currently using Karastas. This one here, which once that's finished, I'll then go back onto the Grow Gorgeous one. But yeah, that's a lovely smelling and really, really nice shampoo and conditioner. I'm then going to be using this. It's the, again, Car is it Karastas? It is, isn't it? Karastas, yeah. Um, it's just an oil which I put a little bit of my hands and then I just whack it all on the ends I've also got this which I use which smells really good it's a smooth booster hydrating hydrating serum thing I also just shove a bit of that on as well honestly me and my hair serums I've got so many oh my god my hair is falling out so much I whack a bit of that on and I'll tell you what else is really good as well is this NutriCare by Fenola. They do a really, really, yeah, it's for help split ends. So I also use that as well sometimes. But yeah, I'm now going to blow dry my hair and um, I'm going to try straightening it because GHD have kindly sent me the GHD Max Professional Wide Style Plates. So I'm going to give these a bit of a whirl and I will show you the finished product. So this is the final look. I mean, I really liked and I enjoyed using them because they're a bit bigger. It's a lot quicker to straighten your hair. But yeah, I never really have my hair straight, but I quite like it. I put these little clips in just to clip back the front, but. So my brand new Sunnies have just arrived um, from this brand right here. They're an Australian brand, uh, but I will link them below. But again, I got massively influenced by numerous gals on Instagram. So I thought, right, here we are. Got myself a pair. 
what do we think? I mean, are they a bit big for my face? I don't know. But they're an Australian brand. I'm just loving this Australian brand life right now. I honestly get me to bloody Sydney. It's where I belong. And also, what do you guys think? I've coloured in. Normally I cover up all my like are they moles i don't know i don't like calling it the freckles i cover up all my freckles but i've actually like colored them in and made the, these two a bit darker I, i'm scared people are going to come up to me like excuse me you've got some food on your face that you've obviously quite clearly like missed or like what's that on your face i'm just gonna have to be like honey i was born with those first beer first beer of the season how is it lovely <laughs> sweet, sweet oh my god <laughs> Um, Say something funny. Try and neck it. Go on then. No, we're in a posh place, can't do that. We are now out for dinner at a place called Moochie's. Shut down it again. Is all the <laughs> oh gosh. He's been locked up for way too long, honey. Unleash the beast. We've never eaten here before, have we, Harv? No, we're not. Oh, Moochie's? Yeah. So we're just sitting here, I've got a glass of rosé, it feels good to be back. We're just by the double yellow, double yellow. We're on the road, but it's fine. We love to see it. It's got that European vibe, that sitting in the streets, it's quite nice. Yeah, I quite like it. Shame it's not the same about the weather in, like, Italy. Yeah, I'm freezing my tits off. Yeah, I'm freezing my absolute tits off. <laughs> so, today, I mean... I'm wearing sunglasses because I honestly feel down. so tired because I've been up since four. closing. I'm going to work on something very, very exciting, which I actually cannot wait. Oh, not press one. I cannot wait to show you guys what I've been working on. I mean, we've got a while until it launches, but when it does, I think you're going to love it. So today I'm going into my first ever shop. I'm doing a bit of shopping. I'm going on the King's Road. I thought I'll walk to the King's Road, get my steps in, do a bit of mooching around there because I need to go to Zara. I haven't shopped in Zara in months. I've got my new Prada bag. Look at me go. I thought I'd treat myself because, well, I haven't in so long and why not? I never ever buy my, like once a year I'll buy myself a nice bag anyway i've got this oversized blazer on which is from top shop asos and then i've got on these like flared legging things is my outfit let's go do some damage like if i purchase anything i mean i hope i, I reckon i'll probably be not to be depressing or anything but i reckon there will be a bit of a letdown going in there just because i can imagine there's just a load of shit they're trying to get rid of that <laughs> from like a couple of seasons ago but let's give it a go let's give it a go i've also just been filming like a couple of like little instagram haul thing because i thought i'll do some of all the like little summer bits that i've got going on at the moment because i just i've been trying on outfits and planning outfits for summer where where is summer summer if you're there you can you can come out now you can we can actually like enjoy some heat please I looked at my um I looked at my last year's photos and it I was sunbathing in the sun. This year I'm wrapped up warm in a big old jacket. Actually just fully changed. Um I've made last minute decision. I'm now wearing I'm still wearing trousers with the shoes, but oh my god my room's a mess, but I'm now wearing this little reclaimed vintage long jumper because I just thought oh, I'd rather be a bit more comfy, less cash. I'm not going to eat out or anything. So it's more of, you know, shopping attire, I'm thinking. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Maybe I've lost my head in lockdown and now um, I'm out here trying to be cool when, do you know what? I've just got to give it up and realise I'm an old hag. Also... Let me tell you, the hay fever is doing me seriously dirty today. My nose is more blocked up than a lot of things that are blocked. Um, my eyes are itching. I don't think I've, I don't think I've ever had hay fever before, but it's playing a cruel trick on me. So I got some new hand wash 
from Space NK. I mean, it's very basic, bitch. I feel like everyone has it. So that's why Ems has had to have one. <laughs> and I feel like, look, it just goes with my bathroom once I get rid of all that crap so well. <laughs> and then I just got a refill of this NARS concealer, which I'm obsessed with. And I've literally used my other one all up. It's so good. Then from Zara, I mean, I didn't get that much. I got these little shorts, which I thought with a bikini would look really nice. I love the fact that I'm buying clothes for holidays, which we currently aren't allowed to go on. So <laughs> that's always great. And then just this little tank as well, because not only did it go with that, but I also just need some plain tanks for the summer. So tonight we are off to Zuma to have some food with Ollie and Gareth, which we got. We basically booked this ages ago. Wearing the outfit, well, kind of the same blazer I was meant to wear out the other day, but I've paired it with my Stuart Wiseman boots, which I haven't actually worn in literally, I want to say two years. <laughs> I thought I'd get them out, but I, f I forgot I had them to be honest. I um, found them at the top of my wardrobe. I was like, oh yeah, I've got a pair of those. I'm wearing them now. Um, it feels kind of weird wearing heels, I won't lie. Like, I feel like my feet are gonna really, really hurt. I haven't put heels on in so long because obviously we've not been out or able to. If this is about the, I've been eat, I've eaten out about every single day since everything's open, but I'm here with mum. We're having a little lunch, aren't we? I've got some machine on the go. Love. So Rach told me just to get the vlog out because she absolutely loves being featured, don't I you? I don't. I said, whatever you do, Emily, let's not vlog today because I can't bear it. She absolutely loves the live night, Rach. Oh, do you know what? I'm thinking of starting a, my own Insta page. No, it's YouTube. Oh, YouTube. Oh, yeah, rewind. Uh, no. <laughs> cut, cut that one out. No, I'm thinking of vlogging myself. I'm going to call it a rog. A rog. Oh, Rachel's Rachel. rogs, yeah. <laughs> Rachel Roggs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think that will work well. Comment yeah. below if you think you should uh, you'd sign up to a rog. We have just had a lovely lunch yeah. and now we are off to have a little glass of wine because it's such a glorious day. We're out of lockdown. And we're out of lockdown. Ish. Yeah. Ish, yeah. But still, better than being locked away. Right, girls, I've just come back from um, my smear test. <laughs> My granddad's come to pick me up. He's 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 not. He doesn't know anyway, I just thought I'd jump on here and say, you know what? It really wasn't that bad. It's not the most pleasant thing, and I can't say it's ladylike, but it's very important that you get it done because I know that there is a bit of like people are scared to go, and I don't know. I feel like there's a bit of a stigma around it, but I must say I was absolutely fine. Um, I make sure I go yearly just because. You know, it, I just think it's a good thing to do. But yeah, lovely stuff, really. Love being a woman. So, oh my God, I <laughs> to excuse the absolute state of me. I've just had a spray tan and I haven't washed it off yet. I can't wash it off for like eight hours. Honestly, you can, my teeth are just glowing. However, I've just realized whilst editing this, it's a bit mishmashy and I kind of just jumped to all loads of different days. So I'm sorry if it didn't really make sense, but yeah. I will try to get better at that, but thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked this little vlog video. It should be out very, very soon. I'm going to vlog the rest of this week for you guys. Um, so yeah, lots of love.